Hi, um, this is Sam and welcome to Make It So. So me and Carol were talking about fashion of the 24th century and I mentioned that we were going to the annual Starfleet Klingon Banquet in October organised by the wonderful Kellen of Starbase 24. Anyway, I mentioned I was going to wear the TNG Scant uh, from season one. Um, and I bought the pattern on Roddenberry.com and it finally arrived <laughs> and it was it was much more complex. It's the uh, probably I think it's the original design from William Ware thesis. Sorry if I've not pronounced that right. But these are all the um, different parts, all the different pattern pieces. Now I'm a bit of an amateur sewist, so um, this is kind of my Kobayashi Maru test. Um, after reading through the instructions, it just come with um, little basic bits of instructions. The, the logic was sound after a while, but still quite complex. So, like you do in the Kobayashi Maru test, you cheat, according to Penny. Anyway, so what I've done, I've kind of simplified it a bit. I've um, taken out all the scant pieces, so I cut all these patterns, and I kind of thought I'd keep it simple. So what I've Oops. What I've done is I've kind of folded over some of the side panel pieces. I'm just going to cut two of them. So I'm just going to make it into a real basic dress. Um, I'm using Lycra. They use spandex um, on the show. And it's... Um, I've got the shiny side up, but I'm actually going to use the matte side. It's more of a matte side. I'm going to use that for the outer side, so. Um, but I do quite like the shiny look, I don't know. Maybe we'll see, but at the moment, this is where I am, so. Oh, it, it, this is the bit that looks difficult, the, the top piece, the yolk, how that all fits together. So you've got the contrasting yellow, which comes piping. I might have to cheat at that too and just buy some piping. I've got um, Star Trek playing in the background as a bit of motivation. Um, what else was I going to show? Oh yeah, I was going to show you my little bits and pieces I bought of Roddenberry. So I've got my communicator, which goes on by Velcro. Um, I've got my my pips. I've decided to go for um, Lieutenant Lieutenant Commander. Yeah, I thought I was going to go for Captain, naturally, but I was like, oh, and I got some. I got some Swarovski well, crystals. Um, I just saw them in the shop and thought, you know, I've got to, I've got to have that really. So, um, yeah, this is make it so. I think we're just getting to the part where they blow up the USS Landry. So, um, I'm going to have to go stand and pay my respects. Okay, uh, all my pieces are now all cut out, and here's my little pieces here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start on the collar first which are all these little pieces, um, as well as making my contrasting bias strip cording, which has to go through this. I think I'm going to have to do a lot of internet research beforehand. Um, I feel bad cheating on this a little bit, like not making it into a proper scan, but the thing is, is with the dress, it looks like a dress, like you can tell there's a little flappy bit there, but overall it's been designed to look seamless, and if I attempt that, it's not going to look seamless. Anyway, I've switched to watching um, Ghostbusters now, as um, Star Trek has finished on CBS for the day. So, uh, let's give it a try.